Oh, hello, and welcome back to More Freedom Game Studios here in the Mad Game Tycoon 2. Um, we've got Working in the Mines is chilling over here. Maybe we finally into the cash money at $584,000, and we're still waiting three weeks on the More Freedom Series 93, which should open it for the Christmas gifting window. So I'm trying to get, we need to get some of that hype going right now. Let's release the demo for it. So we'll get some hype going for the More Freedom Series 93. We have, if you'll recall, we've got Escape from the Middle Ward under development and the new game, Cyber Paintball World. So that's what we got under development right here in the More Freedom Game Studios. So one-ish week for the Christmas gifting window, 20,000 of the oh, plus two for the demo. Escape from the Orient is off the market, the classic version. So that's nice. My phone has been blowing up all day. I don't, I don't you, you start recording videos and your phone starts blowing up. Oh no, immersion breaking. Just kidding. So more freedom series is open. We are open for business. It opens at number two in the charts with 32,000, 32,000 orders. So let's get some more freedom series 93. Let's get some magazines going. Oh, working in the mines, working in the mines. Nope, nope. We're, oh my gosh. Game of the year, baby. Let's go. Unexpected right there. Super exciting and unexpected. The More Freedom Series 93, who released last week. Game of the year. I, I'm super pumped by that. I am so ridiculously pumped by that. So that's awesome. Hopefully that's a boost in our, in everything. We're going to continue development on escape from the mental ward. I'm very, very surprised that we got game of the year for the more freedom series 93, but listen, I'm not, I'm not going to complain about that. Uh, that is done. Let's kill that off. Let's get them to Cyber Paintball World. Ooh, we got everything going for that one now. Hopefully, it does put us to number one for the More Freedom Series 93. That is so exciting, man. That's awesome. I think we even got a boost for working in the mines for that. So, very, very cool. Very awesome. What do we got going on over here? Hopefully that, let's check our, what does that do for our, our IP stuff? There's a way for us to tell that. What's the, uh, well, let's check our engines. Market dominance is medium. Can I? Is this where I do that? Oh. So we could. I don't know. What if we bring that down to like 6% and then up that to like. What if we did? I'm going to try this just to see if it makes a difference. Uh, I don't think 200,000. What if we put it at like a hundo? If I can get it to right there. And maybe 3%. I don't know. Let's see if it does any different. Because I would love for people to use it. I was letting to see my IP. Market research. Customer support. Own games? 
My IPs. Okay. Oh, the More Freedom series is popularity I the IP. The More Freedom series. We need to get another Ice Man out there. Is what we need to do. And the Escape series needs another. Well, we're I think we're working on one, aren't we? We are. So we need to get another Ice Man out there. We've got the Ice Woman, the Ice Man. So we're gonna need another Ice series. But Escape from the Middle Ward is almost done. Well, it's done for everything as far as normal normal processing goes. Right? Right. So we're going to reassign this support to Paintball World. And I'm so ex that was just so unexpected on the game of the year. We should we we yeah, we need to let's see corridor Best graphics, soundtrack, game of the year, baby. That's got to go right there. That's got to go in the drunk tank with Harvey. There's only three people in there. We'll get them hyped up by having game of the year just chilling in there. Um, don't really need to do any marketing at this point. Oh, we could do some special marketing for Escape from the Mental Ward. So we can re let's release a beta demo. It's got some bugs. Let me tell you, it's it's got a few bugs in it. enthusiastic about the more freedom series 93 so i think because i was one i was thinking in my head that i should release all that stuff like right at the christmas gifting window but i should release it on second week of november a plus nine to escape from the mental ward we need to come up with some more es escape type deals you know what i'm saying Down to number two in the charts, but we've already made $4.7 million on the More Freedom Series 93. How insane is that? Like, I guess, you know, game of the year, I guess. Working in the mines off. Oh, we made 911000 on working in the mines, so that's actually pretty good. Um, engine fees. Yeah, that'll do her. And I'm honestly not sure if using my engine on just everything, even though it's technically designed for um, racing games, if that works. So if I did, if I did this real fast. I think I can pump those out. Escape from the hospital off. The Iceman is gone. Again, we've made the More Freedom series 89 has made 300,000. 87 has made 260,000. And the Ice Woman has made 130,000. Okay, cancel this. Get them on graphics for Paintball World. Very nice. Um, we have all of the things production. We got stock room. We, we don't need a server room because we don't have an MMO. I think eventually we want to do a, a free to play game. Um, because listen, I've got it. I've got another, I got another studio that I do that I, I build like I play it. I play this in more than one series. You know what I mean? It's just when I play it for fun by myself. And the pirates, the pirate studios has free to play and that's where it's made all its money. 
It's that monthly subscription. It, well, it's not monthly subscription. It's, um... Internet has been unlocked. Uh, it's not monthly subscription. It's the, um, whatever, you know, garbage pa paid things. Hey, Ice Woman is off. 130,000. Can't complain about that at all. More Freedom Series has made seven million dollars marketing campaign game more freedom series i'm just gonna throw out just let's just give it a little bit of a tickle you know hey this this game's still here this game's still here it's only been out 13 weeks it was like hey we're top of the top of the chart oh game developer legend could we we'd have to expand I don't know if we have any place for a game developer legend, to be real honest. I mean, what we need to do is... How much is this? Four million. So... If we... Buy this, we could move... I'm thinking here. So... If we buy that we could get a game developer in over here. Okay. Uh, uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Development. I'm going to put the door over here like that. Okay, so here's what I'm thinking is that let's get Okay, seven people we're going to go with seven. We'll fill them up as we go. Let's get our, let's, I mean, let's do, let's get wild over here and put in a water dispenser. Oh no. We should put in a coffee maker. That's what we should put in. Let's put our radiators in. Medicine cabinet. Sure they know what time it is. There's the clocks. So what I'm thinking here is this is my plan. Where's the trash cans at? Trash cans. like the obey posters. Um, so what, what I'm thinking here is that I want to do, I want to hire one. I want to hire the game, the, the legend. If I could speak in my head, so I'm going to do, that is not what I want. I want job market. We want game design. You want to put the legend in over here. I'm just going to leave it whatever their name is. And dev ops tank. Okay. Let's get this guy job market. What kind of programmers do I have? I'm going to hire all these, these four programmers. I I'm running out of ways to name people. So we're just going with Fidelius Trishinsky. Uh, you're in. And 
and Cali Holoco. And Glorious Ishmalio. Okay, that's five. So what we're gonna do is let's get because what I'm thinking is that I need a good game developer. I don't know why. I just feel like I do. I feel like I need a good game developer. Just a, one game developer and the rest is programmers in there. And we're going to start them off with developing a game and... The Ice Woman Returns. So we're going to go with that. Action, all of that. What if we went adult on it? PC Macintosh. But it doesn't tell me if it has technology level 3. But these are also technology level 3, and they didn't have online or LAN or anything like that. We'll put one toward game depth. Core? Casuals. We'll leave it like that. Give me everything. And then we'll decide what we don't want. Well, what if we did that? Oh, because it, it does actually want everything. So arcade joystick. No. Character customization, cheat codes, character progression, checkpoints, controller support. Uh, dynamic music, Easter eggs, keyboard support, level editor, land, light gun is gone, local high scores, mini games, multiple ends, new game plus, online multiplayer, pause function, password saves is gone, repeatable quest, save, secret, skills tree, side quest, voice acting, tutorial, um... Get rid of hmm. Easter eggs and I'm not. No, I want that. I'm going to do many games. So we've got 30 things. And yes, excuse me. Okay, the Ice Woman Returns is up and running. So we're gonna need, we're gonna need a bathroom and stuff over here for this building. So let's just go ahead and put in the bathroom I'm going to start with this and I might have to make it bigger because I don't remember how big these toilets are. One, two, three, four. Okay. So we can fit four in over here and then we can do a trash can. Hand dryer, a couple hand dryers. I wish they could be closer. You know what I'm saying? I wish that it could just get, I, I want wash basin. Okay. And then right here in the middle radiator. Like, can I put a clock on the back of these? No. <laughs> clock by the door. 
put a clock right right there in the bathroom. Listen, you've been in here using the the crapper. What are, what are these? The crapper three. And over here in the corridor, let's get a Sputnik. And can we put a med medicine cabinet in here too? Who knows? We have one in here. We do. And a medicine cabinet out here. And a radior radiator. Oh, that's an electric. Yeah, we, we just want a radiator right there. Because they'll complain about being cold when they come in here. So, like, oh, I'm so cold, even though it's like summer outside. I'm just saying. Okay. Don't have any of that. Okay, so that's good. Yeah, see, see how she's cold? So what we need to do is put a radiator right here. Run right here. One right here, one right here, right here. Now it's heating up. Hey, we've done nine million dollars on the More Freedom Series 93. So that's pretty amazing. More Freedom Series 87 is off the market. So what I'm also thinking is, is that, oh, I didn't do that. So what I can do is I can move these. I want to move this room. Like I can move it over here. And then I can also move. Hey, nice. Very nice. Uh, this guy, I'm going to sell. And can I move this again and then do like that? Yep. And then this room, yep, just right there. You guys move this room. It's high, the definition of high realism right there. Moving them to an, a different spot. So, because what I'm thinking is, is that the beefy tank might expand, right? Um, let's get a lounge in here. So this was three, like that, and we're gonna put a door. Because we need, listen, they need to lounge. Uh, dart machine, uh, for sure. Right there. Mini golf. Let's put, let's get some chairs in here first before I do anything else. What kind of T not don't have a modern TV yet. Okay. Okay. Uh, fridge. You know, that's going to be nasty at some point. Like, you know how, you know how, if you've ever worked in an office environment, you, you know what I'm saying? Like at some point that, excuse me, that fridge is going to just be absolutely horrible. Get a medicine cabinet in here. Again, I wish, I wish you could get things just a little bit closer because look how much room I could save. Right there, clock, clock me. Plantage. Now let's come up here and get, let's get some mini golf in right there. Arcade cabinet, because you know, we work on video games all day. We should definitely have arcade cabinets in here too. Keyboard. Sure. 
Let's get some uh, posters up. Oh, aliens for sure. Robot. There we go. And then do we have a uh, can we put a carpet in? There. Look at that. Would you look at that? What did I call this? Was the liquor ace. And this is the yellow jack. And this is the, I was trying to think of another GTA, uh, the vanilla unicorn. That's the vanilla unicorn. Oh, this would be uh, third. Third crapper. Okay, so they're developing the Ice Woman Returns. Got customer support. We've got that stuff going. Um, so I'm trying to think of any other ones that I want to move over there. And I could move the exterminators over and make their make give them more. So let's move them over to here. Oh. Like such. And sell that item. And sell that item. So what we're gonna do is we're going to expand their room because they definitely need more people. That there, move that guy over right there, right there, right there, right there, right there, right there. Give me this. We need to exterminate more bugs is basically what I'm saying here. Uh, can we get like a regular cabinet? Oh, sure. Let's get a regular cabinet in there. That guy. Radiators. There's one right there already. Put one right here. We're going to see if that does anything for us. Um, plant. Plantage there, right there, and right there. Move that guy to there. Like that. And let's put our notorious posters up. Okay. Uh, the exterminators. 
So we got 12 people we can fit in there. So job market programming, and we'll fill these up as we can get them. Yeah, they're programmers, right? Oh, let's make sure. Oh, they're game testers. That's a programmer, a DevOps tank. There you go. Sorry, you're getting moved already? That's like my job. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm t I can't name people anymore. <laughs> I ran out of names. So we're just getting everything. Okay, so we made that, okay. Job market, let's get another game tester in here. That's eight, nine. I assume that these are supposed to be game testers. It makes sense to me, but I could be very, very wrong on that. You know what I mean? And they are absolutely slaying out those bugs. Look at that. Uh, let's get a some radi a radiator in here, so then they don't complain about being cold. We got that guy, so that's good. We got a nice lounge and crapper over here. And I think eventually this will be our server room. We can put the server room right there. Um, okay. So now we have a bunch of stuff. Six. Do we have one more programmer that we can put in? We do, but they create too many bugs. Do that. Consolidation of things, of areas. Uh, continue development, yes. Okay, now we need to, that's good, that's good. Um, escape from the middle ward is almost ready. Escape from the middle ward is ready to go. So, self-distribution. No, we're going to go two weeks because I want to. Come on, baby. 72. We'll get that up. Excuse me. We'll get that up. Uh, produce game and escape from the mental ward. Let's go 250. And let's go three, four thousand on these, and two thousand on these. And can I do? We're going to cancel this and do automatic. Like that. Okay. What do we got sitting in here? Yes. 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 Sell all of these that aren't in stock right now. Let's get all, let's get our stock cleared out. We're going to keep working in the mines. And the more freedom series 91, anyone that's basically not a classic or whatever, they can just, you know, somebody's buying them from us. So we can, re I think we can release working in the mind. So if we do that as a budget game, 30 weeks. Um, more freedom series 91. Hey, number five. Oh, we can also special marketing. Publish a demo. 
Let's go. And they are done. The junk tank is just, oh, they don't need support. Cancel that. Let's do commission work. Get some commission work going there. Uh, they don't need done. Let's do a large booth because we're going to take Escape from the Middle Ward. More Freedom Series 93 because they're on sale. And then we're going to do Cyber Paintball World because it'll be our next game out. Nice, nice. Um, reassign support to the Ice Woman Returns. Those are doing good. Get the exterm exterminators going on Cyber Paintball World. Lots of bugs to fix on that, too. <clears throat> now, do we have any more programmers? Let's see if we have any more programmers chilling. We do not. But we do need some game testers, though. Job market. We need two game testers. There's one. And... <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, so our game testers are good. And they're like, oh, I'm so cold. Uh, I'll throw I'll throw a radiator in there. Maybe a trash can. Did I not put any radiators in the vanilla unicorn? It's just cold in there. I like it's so cold in the vanilla unicorn. It's so cold. We're going to double it up with two of them right there. There you go. How about that? How about those beans? What do they think of our rooms? Quality of your offices. Those are fantastic. These are fairly good-ish. Oh, Cyber Paintball World is done for the Tuba Tank. Cancel task. Let's get them over to the Ice Woman Returns. We're going to end that automation because we need to get more Freedom Series 95 going right now, right away, right away. Who do we have for research? Oh, we've got several people. So we got one, two, three, four people. I'm actually just, what I'm going to do is I'm going to hire them. And then we're going to expand the room. So we need to add five desks to this room. Which we're going to do by going like this. And then we're going to say work desk two. And let's get radiator in here. One right here. It's an odd room, which I know we could do some different things with. The 
creepy cat, cat painting. Okay. Plant. I sell that. And I could have put it down there. We're going to put a clock down here. Okay, and then we just need one more researcher to fill that up, which we don't have, So, but that's fine. This guy's got to go like here into the depths. Oh, you know what we could put in there is we could put in a medicine cabinet though. A couple of those. It's not speed, I swear. Okay, that's good, that's good. They are working on Cyber Paintball World. Cyber Paintball World is coming along. Escape from the Mental Ward is doing really good. And the More Freedom Series 93 is still number two in the charts. How awesome is that? I mean, it did get Game of the Year and everything. So, I mean, yes. Let's uh, just do some posters. Let's throw some posters out there. Cyber Paintball World. Let's make sure we got the... Let's get a demo out for that. If Or, I mean, a pre-release thing. Flight stick support. We don't need right now. Uh, special marketing for... Cyber Paintball World. Let's release the beta demo first. And then we'll do a pre-release for the pet press. There we go. Nice. Very nice. And then we'll do our pre-release for the press. I'm gonna hit the speed up button here. I want to get that copy protection done. 3% on that. I, I, I wish that this guy would be done before the Christmas gifting window, but I know it's not going to be. Okay. Continue development on the Ice Woman Returns. Definitely. This is almost done. Let's get them going on develop a game. Sequel. This. That. 95. Oh, yeah. We're going to do this anyway. Yes. Game size A. Yes. I'm just putting it on these because they allow us to do online multiplayer game depth. So move that down and move it that up. And move that that up. Can we do but then that gives us three points. Eight. So I need one point. Let's try that. Casual. Something like that. Okay, we need to get rid of five. Adjustable controls, character customization. We're going to get rid of the jo arcade joystick. Cheat codes. Let's take it out for right now. Cutscenes, dynamic music. We don't need flight stick support. We could use force feedback, keyboard support, LAN, level editor. We'll leave it in for right now. Local high scores, modern controller support. We don't need those. We don't need that. We need, we need that. New game plus online multiplayer. Password saves is gone. Pause function, quick time events is gone. Um, repeatable quest, save games, rewind function, sure. 
split screen multiplayer is gone. So we have one that we can add. Uh, wheel support is a yes. We could do orchestral soundtrack or I'm not doing password saves. Let's give it a good soundtrack, I suppose. Plus 40 already for the More Freedom Series 95, which I don't even know will be able to come out. It's got a year of development it can do. So these guys are done. Um, we want to do... We're not going to research everything automatically because we don't want to lose our shirts. But we will do the, the double A games. And then we need to do some stuff to make our engine better. So we definitely need to do that. Uh, let's check these things out. Squash and bugs on Cyber Paintball World. They are supporting here, so this is done. We're gonna reassign the support for this over to More Freedom Series 95. Ad tank, what are you doing? Let's check some, let's do some special marketing for the Ice Woman Returns. Let's release a beta for that. Cyber Paintball World is almost complete. We've got 45% halfway done on the final thing from the crayon tank. And again, I think it's going to be at this point where we're making some of these rooms bigger. Um, so like the crayon tank probably needs to... Yeah, basically we just need to make it bigger than what it is. Because four, four people is a very small crayon tank. So I suppose we could move it over here and then double the size of it and possibly make eight people. Do we even have eight people? Ooh, researcher. I think we have a we have room for that. Yes. Do we even have eight people or four more people we could hire for graphics design? We have one. We have one. Motion Capture Studio. That was, I was actually just thinking was, is that do we have motion capture available yet? And so now we have motion capture available. Ice Woman Returns, minus 3%. Oh, just middle fingers to you. So Cyber Paintball World is almost complete. I don't think we're going to get it out in time for the Christmas gifting window. We could uh, fast forward a little bit and see what happens, but I don't think we will. Cyber Paintball World is not complete yet. It's just done with the... Uh... Okay, so... No more bugs. Let's move... Let's cancel this. Let's put them on to gameplay for The Ice Woman Returns. Because that'll be our next game. Um, 68% on that. So we're not going to get it out, I don't think, by the time the Christmas gifting window rolls around. One week. 86%. Oh, hold on. Before we do this, Cyber Paintball World, the cancel. Oh, it's done. It's done. Um, okay. Cancel this task. Finish development. It is done. Self distribution. All of that stuff. Next week. Eighty seven percent. Heck yeah. Let's get produce a game. And Cyber Paintball World, let's do 100,000. And let's say 1,000, because I want to get it out there. We 
because cyber Christmas gifting window is next week. So I want to do some production on it and let's check our support is on that. That one is good. Let's get the crayon tank over to the ice woman returns. They are on the ice woman returns. They are chilling. So let's get them going with some commission work for right now. Let's get them doing some commission work and then we'll figure out what we want, but let's hit play and see what happens here. Cause we should get our best graphics, best soundtrack. Oh, didn't get game of the year, but Hey, we got best graphics and best soundtrack for Escape from the Mental Ward. Christmas gifting window is open. Cyber Paintball World is for sale. And let's get this over to automatic production. So we're going to see if Cyber Paintball World does anything. Oh, because it didn't actually come out until right now. So 13,000 in the first week, uh, marketing campaign escape from, nope, nope. We want special marketing for cyber paintball world. Let's publish the demo. We'll see what the demo gives us here. These, this is going, these are doing their thing. Port tank is fine because they don't have anything. Plus one on the demo for Cyber Paintball World. We don't have much ad stuff on that. So let's get Cyber Paintball World. Let's hit it with some radio ads. And then we're in the Christmas gifting window. It's sold 25,000 copies. More Freedom Series 93 is still number four in the charts and has done one million copies. So, which is just insane. It was game of the year. So there will be a More Freedom Series 93 game of the year edition that comes out. And they, the, big, the big issue is, is that we've got More Freedom Series 95 will be coming out this time next year. Or yes. So what do we do, you know, but that's going to save it for the next episode. And if you're enjoying this game as much as I am, make sure you come back, like, subscribe, all that junk and stuff. And then we'll see you in the next episode of uh, the More Freedom Game Studios. And until then, take care.